If you are looking to store gold and silver with the vault, do not base your decision solely on common terms associated with storage programs such as ownership, allocated, pooled allocated, or segregated. These terms do not have the same meaning across the bullion storage industry. Instead, begin by asking yourself, how can I truly own gold and silver that is stored in a vault? Two criteria are needed before you can own an asset. Firstly, the asset must be uniquely identified. You can own a house because the address is unique. You can own a car because of its license and its VIN number. Similarly, the bullion storage program you select must allow you to own uniquely identified gold and silver. Silver Bullion's storage program ensures that all bullion have unique identifiers called parcel numbers. Even bullion such as coins and bars that do not have serial numbers are accorded unique identifiers from the tamper-evident bags they are sealed in. If your storage provider's deposit documents only state your holdings with the numbers of ounces of bullion stored without unique identifiers, you are almost certainly a creditor to bullion owned by the dealer. Which of the many bars or coins in the vault do you own? Given that there are no unique identifiers, how can you be certain other parties do not also have claims on the same bullion? Such storage programs make you a creditor. The storage company owes you bullion. You merely have a claim on the bullion. Secondly, it is not sufficient for the bullion to just have a unique identifier. There has to be a mechanism to transfer ownership of specific bullion to customers. Certificates of ownership are marketing tools with no legal significance. They are really IOUs. If you have an IOU, the law protects the dealer, not you. In comparison, Silver Bullion's storage program records the unique identifiers of stored bullion on commercial invoices sent to customers. Invoices issued by registered companies are established proof of ownership within the jurisdiction where they are issued. When you store gold and silver with silver bullion, you are an owner and not a creditor because the two criteria for ownership are fulfilled. Your serial numbered invoices issued by a Singapore registered entity like us state the unique parcel numbers of bullion you own in our vaults. These four details on the invoice attest under Singapore law that you own the bullion. With true ownership, the law protects you. Note that tampering with or outright forging an invoice is considered a criminal offense in Singapore, providing strong legal protection to customers. Furthermore, your bullion is fully insured against theft, including inside jobs and mysterious disappearance. Therefore, very little can go wrong. As an owner, your bullion is not on Silver Bullion's balance sheet since we are only an agent to store, insure, and provide audit checks for your bullion until you sell or take delivery of it. Therefore, your bullion will survive any potential dissolution of the company. When you store with us, Silver Bullion can also act as an escrow enabling you to obtain loans with your bullion property on our secured P2P loan platform. Have peace of mind as an owner of bullion by storing with Silver Bullion. Truly secure your wealth today.